Your flute playing sucks. That's how you play a flute. I think it's time, I think it's time to dupe this. That is the wrong screen. Bless Curse Run Redemption, it's true. Again, let me know if at any point the game audio is like too quiet or too loud. Um, same with the the balance on the game versus the aerophone, game versus me talking. Um, I was shocked at how loud this game is um, in the recordings. Speaking of loud, hello, Eleventy. Loud. Shackle him, restrain him, nothing. That doesn't worry any. Again, the we didn't shackle him or restrain him, that doesn't worry anybody, and just walking by comedic brilliance that has to be done on purpose. Game is a little loud. The game could be louder, and the aerophone is a little too loud. Thank you. Oh, the game also might have been muted. Loyal wolf, I see you are. Who needs the game anyway? True. That's a very good point. Who who thinks it's a good idea to play video games on Twitch, not TV? See, let me double check the aerophone. Um, hold on. Aerophone could just be a little loud. Um, I will I will. Let's do it actually. About there, and then in here. I hope that's better. Why no Japanese dub? Uh, for variety's sake. Um, is having the music on intentional? Um, the music, the game music, yes. Is uh, that balance a little bit better now, Solaire? Sure, and it's, it's more just I'm trying to get the balance right between all of the different audio sources that I currently have. I want people to, I want the I want the audio this is something that I try to do in general when I'm mixing is I want all of my audio to kind of live 
ultimately, like, I want the final output to be right around negative three dec decibels. Right around negative three. I don't want it to get too much louder than that. But I also don't want to be too much quieter than that either, because I don't want people to, like, have to crank their systems to hear me. There we go. Thank you, everybody. Um, would you say that just going further into new game is viable? XP farm, not really farm anymore. Just go through the game. Yes. Until you get to a certain point. Um, if you are trying to platinum Sekiro... Um, just work through all of the other trophies, leave the skill stuff for last. Um, and then once you have every other trophy, if you have access to the battlefield outside of uh, Demon of Hatred, um, for farming, that's where you do the last bit. Again, because then when you actually get to that point, all you have left is Lazulite upgrades and skills, then there you go. Play through the rest of the game until you get all of the Lazulite stuff that you need. And then um, if you have access to the, that, um, not Bonfire, that statue before Demon of Hatred that I was talking about, um, then go there. It's like 45 skill points on attack power. Yes, you did. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> Hey Mimi, hello! Happy New Year to you as well. It's so nice to see you. How are you? An absolute, absolutely goaded uh, Discord member, uh, member of the Discord community, um, absolutely destroying it with the uh, food and craft pictures. Um, if you would like to join the Discord, there it is. Feel free. Um, but Mimi, it is wonderful to see you. Um, let's go ahead and scurry on here scurry Yes, goaded. What bread did you make?
That sounds lovely, Mimi. Making making just like white sandwich bread is actually surprisingly tricky. I find. In a in a home situation. I know Joshua Weissman. Well, my holiday. <laughs> um, I'm sure I, I'm sure you saw on the Discord that with the updates, but um, in terms of the actual travel, um, I was one of the people affected by all the Southwest Southwest flight cancellations, um, and it sucked. It was the worst travel experience I have ever had. Yeah, I was held captive in Florida. It was awful. Um, I'm glad I got out. I'm glad I was able to make it home. I still need to send in my claims for excuse me, for a refund on the return ticket, on a refund on the Lyft drives that I had to uh, set up, on the two hotels that I had to stay at, and the um, uh, rental car plus gas plus parking um, plus food. So hopefully I can get my money back from all of that. That would be nice. I have the receipts. It's just a matter of whether or not they um, do anything about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm I'm very 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 lucky and privileged to have um, had access to be able to spend the money for those things. Um, but I would like that money back, please, <laughs> because it was still a lot, and it's not money that I was wanting to spend. If that makes sense. Anyway. Monster, hello. Don't use that. Monster, how you doing? And I'm calling you Monster. Hope that's okay. Okay. Monster, good. Yes, previously infernal. Yes, indeed.
And I will say the other the other thing that I'm mostly mad about um, with the travel issues. I think the thing that's most annoying to me is the fact that it took essentially four days away from me out of my vacation. That was the worst part. Um, is it you? No. <laughs> no. Hello. Also, hello, Tarky. The Paul Reiser special. I don't know. Who, I don't know who that is. Off the top of my head. I am. I am just. I'm far too old. I'm too Gen Z for you, Tarky. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Mad about you? Yes. Is it you? Yes. Okay. As in mad about you. Gotcha. It's from the '90s. I don't remember much about the 90s other than um uh ocarina of time um let it go the dog with the butter let it go the buck butter bumble the dog with the butter. Butter. y'all played buck bumble did y'all y'all better have played buck bumble best game of that generation um but Tarky, it's nice to see you no the thing that was annoying is it took four days out of my took four days out of my vacation and so I've got to go back to work tomorrow and I don't feel, I still feel like I'm still catching up on the ordeal that I dealt with last week, which sucks. 90s was Diddy Kong Racing. Hell yeah, I love Diddy Kong Racing. I played FIFA, Road to World Cup 98, and Metal Gear Solid mainly in the 90s. I did not play Metal Gear Solid until um, Twin Snakes for GameCube. And then I ripped through, and this, I think this was the summer before Snake Eater came out. The summer before Snake Eater. So a couple months before Snake Eater. So I played through Twin Snakes and then immediately was like, I've got to play Metal Gear Solid 2 because that was amazing. And then I, uh, and then I went and played uh, uh, Metal Gear Solid 3 when it came out that year for Christmas. So I believe that would have been 2004. You have a lot of points, Elaine. Holy moly. Almost there for the VIP, but you are, you're already a VIP. It'd make you double VIP. B V I I P P. Um, anyway. Didn't even have to use a single ash. Thank you. This is some absolutely filthy chatting happening right now. 
do see it. I see it. Shadow Bunny, hello. Sorry to say that, but you, you're absolutely crazy. I mean, good crazy, but crazy. How do you get these ideas? Shadow Bunny, it is a good question. Um, I my my brain is um gone at this point, so uh <laughs> but thank you for being here. Um and thank you for the kind words. I hope you're having a nice time and a nice evening. And is that Lady G? Lady G, hello. Also, Shadow Bunny, thank you for the follow. Almost. Almost had the magic. Almost had the magic there. Um, you could say his brain is decomposing. True. One hundred percent. Um but thank you for the follow of a Shadow Bunny. Welcome in. Yeah, so Lair, that's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot. It that would take us a while. That would take you a while. Um I'm Goodbye. Oh my god, Desert Fox, hello. You're recreating scarier music than in game. What? Scarier? A lot of the same instruments they use in the score taiko drum and shamisen um, but also desert fox welcome in it's nice to have you here you just beat duo ape charmless i'm happy congratulations that's huge that's a very very difficult fight Doggle was stuck. There we go. Challenge myself to kill every boss Tramos, but no res so route to use. That's, I mean, that is the essence of the challenge run, right? Chain Doger. Uh, I don't know, Solaire. Monk Ghost Remains in Rest. Hopefully, hopefully, if um, we get Deathless tonight, um, that means that we'll have obviously made it to Corrupted Monk. 
I have a new strategy with Corrupted Monk that um, in practice and in other uh, playthroughs, um, if I'm able to pull it off, I can do Corrupted Monk without Corrupted Monk ever getting an attack in. I can't even attack. I'm going to attempt to stun lock it for the entire fight. Okay, cool. Yobu's done. Um, yeah, you do. Uh, I, could, I also forgot that if you like start attacking him before he's done with his uh, monologue, he does yell at you. He gets mad at you. I did forget about that. Mm, not yet travel yet. Oh, I also forgot. Someone mentioned let me um, where was it? Ah, uh, yeah. Snapseed and Ash. It's Snapseed Ash, but also at the beginning of the fight, go in um, for Corrupted Monk. Um, if you empty your entire arsenal of um spirit uh tokens or whatever they're called um on um the firecracker you just firecracker him until you run out of spirit emblems and then use all of the ashes that you have until you run out and then snap seed three times um you will definitely get it um you'll 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 knock him out um without the corrupt monk even attacking uh, let me get this right you play Sekiro on a saxophone and it's at the same time a no death run correct yes um, we've actually done um, other uh, challenge runs of FromSoft games. We've played every single FromSoft game um, at least once on the Aerophone on stream. Um, but we've also done Deathless Bloodborne on the Aerophone. And we've also done level one runs of Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring. And now we're going to try to do Deathless for all seven FromSoft Souls-like games. Um, and then eventually all seven Deathless back-to-back. -back, where if I die in one, I have to start the series over. So... Uh, but we have yet to beat Sekiro Deathless. This we started this about a month ago. Um, I've had some difficulties. Um, thank you for sending me the bucket. The demigod run. What? What? I 
I'm so rusty on the aerophone. Uh, it's so uh, it's so good to see me Newman through this. Thank you, Mimi. I appreciate it. It's feeling so much more comfortable now. I mean. If your phone is old or you have an old battery, there is a chance that your battery is beginning to beginning to show its age. Um, also, if you uh, leave your phone plugged in frequently for long stretches of time. That can that can um, cause the battery to degrade. Um, anyway, but yeah, Mimi, I'm feeling a lot more comfortable with this. I can still die at pretty much any point. Um, I think I've died at, at in every single. At this point, I think I've died at every single moment, on uh, every single um, split on the on the list, except for folding screen monkeys and Miss Noble, which I swear to God, if I am. Dying to either folding screen monkeys or Miss Noble, I need to never do this run. I never I need to just quit. hell out of there. Have I considered playing the game on a musical instrument? No. Actually, um, for real though, um, I know obviously like the aerophone has become like the mainstay of the channel. I'm not kidding though with this new ocarina. If I can remember where I put it, <laughs> it's very funny. I literally had it in my hand like, like, two nights ago and I already don't know where I put it. It's, it's, it's just like not physically in front of me and I have object permanence. So, um, but, uh, I have legitimately considered figuring out a way to program, um, 
in a because I've seen this done before um, acoustic to MIDI uh, translation so I could play um, actual instruments into a microphone and have that control the game and uh, the new ocarina would be actually kind of perfect for that um, Rakote hello Rakote or Rakote hello um, please um, ple please uh, correct me if I'm pronouncing the name incorrectly but welcome in it's nice to have you how are you I also realized uh, how to use the spear later um, that I may or may not be able to use for one specific situation. Um, I was not using the spear during the headless ape fight. Yep, yeah, the ape. The problem is that I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it because I don't know how many uh, spirit emblems I'm gonna have on me. At the end of that because the strategy going into it is going to be it's going to use up a lot of mortal draws <laughs> so we'll see how it goes and i will not be getting the ceremonial tanto in this playthrough i'm sure you are all aware already safe way uh it's so funny because like like i said i've been playing this game offline um and but not doing necessarily deathless attempts um but once you get past new game the first once you get i guess like new game zero i don't know what the proper term for it is but just like the just base game um there's a lot of stuff that you can kind of skip Um, Another one. Where you find the are you gonna do a no hit run after you get this one today? Uh, no. <laughs> Not for the foreseeable future. Um, the plan, Rakote or Rakote or however you say your name. Um, uh, the plan is to do Deathless of all seven from Soft Souls like games, uh, back to back. So a um a demi god run, as it as it were. Um, so instead of the god run hit hitless all seven games it'll be um deathless all seven games but it'll be on the saxophone i think i'm gonna keep using the gun for farm 20 levels a day i mean done in three days drake wr hello welcome in how are you I'm 
You're doing venison stew tomorrow. That sounds lovely. I would love some. That sounds great. Drake WR, thank you for being here. We're having a lovely evening, and um, don't mind, how did you find the stream? And that goes for any of the new folks who are here. If you, um, I would love to know how you found the stream. Um, completely up to you, whether or not you want to divulge that. But um, I like that you automatically farm everything at once. Thank you for doing this. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Um, Anders, or Anders, hello. Um, would you say Sekiro is easier or harder than the other from soft titles on the sax? Um, it's the same. It's the same. Um, I would say there are aspects of it that are harder. Um, just endurance in general. Physical endurance in general. Because there's a lot of button presses. Um, the controls are a bit more complicated. Um, however, the uh, platforming is a hell of a lot more forgiving. <laughs> it's a lot more forgiving than any of the Souls games, um, including Bloodborne. Um, maybe not Elden Ring. Elden Ring is still pretty forgiving. Um, Drake, WR, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, but Sekiro is a lot more um, complicated in terms of the combat itself. That's what makes it tricky. And the platforming sections are still tough. It's the same, and then there's Ludwig. True. Void, hello, it's nice to see you. Paco Explode, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, how are you? How did you find the stream? Thank you very much. Thank you very much for being here and thank you for spreading the word. I'll do an R. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Nice to have you here. All these new all these new folks. Thank you so so much for being here. It's so nice to have you. You're in a Discord call? Rakta. Is that how you pronounce it? Rakta? Told us about what you're doing. Well, welcome in, folks. It's nice to have you all here. How are you doing? Mm. Oh, it's so close. Oh, it is Rakote? Okay. Z09, thank you for the follow. Whoa, what is going on? Saul GC and Bald Runner, thank you for the follows. Thank you for being here. Um, wait, was that is that another one? Or is that just the thing going off? Going off. You're fine, Solaire. You're totally, totally cool. But welcome in, everybody. It's nice to have you all here. Guten what is happening? Hello, Cass Ross. with the raid. There's so many things happening right now. Cass, hello. Just like heaven. Welcome in, Cass. Hello. KCW, hello. Kitecot, hello. Let me move over here. 
Holy smokes. What is happening, everybody? It's nice to have you all here. Um, Mickey Shift, hello. Cass, how was your stream? What were you up to? I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you a shout out here. Give me one second. Just like heaven, thank you for the follow. My bot will catch up in just a moment. There it is, just like heaven. Hello, welcome in. Um Vibrating things are always good. Cass, I literally started playing this last night. For the first time. Yes, yes they are. I started playing this last night for the first time. Um I'm rather enjoying it. <laughs> You're atrocious, all of you. You should be ashamed. Yeah, I'm. I'm really, really, really enjoying it. Um, I. I thought it was. I th so far, so so far, so good. Um, it is cool. Um, I also really like the fact that you can actually um change all the controls to make it play like Dark Souls. <laughs> it actually, it felt like a weird, a weird version of Sekiro when I was playing it. Um, explore everything you can is all I recommend doing. Yes, exactly. Um, but Cass, thank you so much for bringing your folks over. Agree with a bit about vibrating things, Lane. <laughs> okay, hello Raiders. Hello, Raiders. Welcome in. Cass, welcome in. Um, and uh, community members coming over from Cass's. Hello. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Dr. Decomposing. Actual doctor, actual composer. And we are actually playing Sekiro this evening. We're trying to do a deathless run of Sekiro. Um, fr front to back the entire game without dying. Um, but with a twist, we're trying to do that with an electric saxophone as a controller. <laughs> right this is called an aerophone it's basically an electric sax that i've programmed to work as a game controller where every note that i play on the instrument corresponds to a button press on the gamepad there is a little nubbin on the back of the instrument that i use as an analog stick um, but everything else in the game is controlled one doot at a time we've played games like cuphead ocarina of time breath of the wild and the entire from soft souls like catalog that being demon souls dark souls one two and three bloodborne Sekiro, and elden ring um all with the saxophone controller. Um, we've also done sax controlled challenge runs of said games, including, like I said earlier, a deathless run of Bloodborne, um, as well as level one runs of Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring. And now we are trying to do a deathless run of Sekiro with the intent of being able to do deathless on all of those FromSoft games back to back in a row um, without dying. Um, and uh, so far, like I said, we've done Bloodborne deathless. Um, and now we got to do uh, Sekiro Deathless, which we're tantalizingly close to. Um, Dr. Google, thank you for being here. Have a wonderful evening. Um, and Raiders, again, welcome in. Uh, Cass, thanks again. Um, if you need to raid and run, you know the deal. Um, if you need to raid and run, come, please, please, please go take care of yourself. Um, same with the Raiders coming in. But if you are new and you would like to get a better idea of what to expect around these parts, I do have a little raid video prepared. But I hope catches you up to speed. And for those of you who happen to know the words, please feel free to sing along. I'm starving. What's for breakfast? Guten Tag! Johannes Ross! I bring you arts enriched... Dr. Decomposing. Fortified with increased test scores and creative problem-solving skills. It's good! And good for you. Bobby? Susie? Don't worry! That's just the power of the arts! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Dr. Decomposing. I'm a, I'm a oh. <laughs> Over I have a doctorate. This isn't silly. One, two, three, four. Run! I have to fight a ball?
Why? Why indeed. Cass, thanks again for the raid, and welcome back, everybody. Um, there were some questions. Um, Cass asked initially, um, what has been the hurdle on the run so far? I thought I was super close. The hurdle has been time. Time. Um, I, I came really close to getting Deathless um, last Tuesday. Um, was it last Tuesday? Technically, no. No, the Tuesday was two weeks from yesterday. Or two weeks from tomorrow. Two weeks ago, tomorrow, if that makes sense. Um, the, the Tuesday before Christmas um, was my last stream before Christmas break. Um, and I got to the... I, I actually finished the entire Shura run. I died once to the Guardian Ape, not to the final bosses. Um, and then I had to take a few days off and I was planning on coming back the following Monday, the Monday immediately after Christmas. Um, and then, uh, turns out I, uh, got stuck on some flights and was not able to stream, um, not Monday, um, but Friday. Um, so that, that really sucked. So that, that's been the, the determining thing is that I got forced to not stream for almost two weeks. Um, so a little, a, had to do a bit of de-rusting. Uh, so keen to watch, uh, uh, Genichiro. We're almost there. We're almost a Genichiro. Uh, where am I right now, though? Okay, we're good. Just to be safe. Oh, that was a little scary. Um, and shot him down. Uh, thank you for the sub with your Prime Gaming. Very much appreciated. Um, there were actually more questions. You're right. Um, I just realized um, the ultimate dupe run is going to be nine hours long, if not longer. Yes. Yes. If I if I were to do Deathless all in one go, it would take a long time. <laughs> and so, oh, somebody, you had you had a question. Oh, and is the Aerophone an instrument that I normally use on stream as well as generally, or you do normal saxophone stuff off camera? So the Aerophone is a MIDI is a MIDI instrument. Um, in the same way that like a MIDI electric piano, um, you know, uses MIDI messages to um, create sound or to uh, control sounds. Um, the Aerophone does exactly the same thing with the exact same kinds of um, messages, uh, MIDI messages. Um, it's just that it's in a saxophone form instead of piano. So, uh, do you have an estimated total duration for the Golden Deathless Dupe run? Um, it will probably, it would probably be like, like I said, like eight, nine hours, possibly twelve. It would depend. It would depend. Anyway, um, and if, and that would depend on like how often am I taking breaks? How often am I doing this thing where I like talk to chat for a little while? <laughs> uh, because the um, Sekiro Deathless run, the Shura ending, um, is one hour and forty-one minutes, generally speaking. Um, from the multiple times that I have run it um, straight through without stopping, without breaks. Um, that is around the time that I average. It's one hour and 41 minutes. Um, it's obviously going to be longer than that today. Anyway. Hold on. Uh... Hold on. No, we're good. Give me that. All right, Genichiro time. Let's do it. Face me. 
Hello Raiders, welcome in. I'll be with you in just a moment. Platinax, hello. Raid! Oh my god! <laughs> Whip Torque! Oh no! And the videos got frozen! Oh no! Oh no, Whip Torque! What have you done? What is going on? <laughs> arr! Arr! Let's just move over here. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? <laughs> We got there in the end. We got there in the end. That's the important part. Uh, Cursed Wind, hello. Sex mode activated. Uh, I think you meant sax mode. <laughs> but also, hello. Uh, welcome in. Thank you for the raid. And also, Plaid Max, thank you for the raid as well. Um, hello, everybody. Uh, Jesse Jezebel's here. Hello. Saul, hello. Nice to have you here. Um, Rakodi, Rakodi, thank you. Thank you for the GGs. Kenji's here as well. Oh, my God. All these wonderful people. Um, nice to have you here. Um, I am here, or did they? It's a good question, gray, gray area. Um, but Plaidmax and Cursed Wind, thank you for the thank you for the raids and the Rada, thank you for the follow. Um, welcome in everybody. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Doctor D, composing, actual doctor, actual composer. And as you may have seen, coming in with those raids, um, as you may have seen, um, thank you, Rada, I appreciate it. Um, and welcome in, thank you for the follow. Um, as you may have noticed, I am trying to do a deathless run of Sekiro, um, but the thing that I was using as a controller is an electric saxophone. That's right. This right here is called an aerophone. It's basically an electric saxophone that I programmed to work as a game controller where every note that I play on the instrument corresponds to a button press on the gamepad. There is. 
a little nubbin on the back of the instrument that I use as an analog stick. But everything else in the game is controlled one doot at a time. Uh, we've played games like Cuphead, Ocarina of Time, Breath of the Wild, and the entire FromSoft Souls-like catalog, that being Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne, and Sekiro, and Elden Ring. I think I got that right. Anyway, um, <laughs> um, but uh, we've also done uh, challenge runs of said FromSoft games on said saxophone. Um, including a Deathless run of Bloodborne, a level one run of Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring. And now we're trying to do Deathless Sekiro with the intent of doing Deathless all of the games, um, all of the FromSoft games, all of the FromSoft Souls-like games, all seven of them, um, the ones that I have listed, trying to do them all back-to-back -back in a demigod run of sorts. Um, Deathless, if I die in one game, I have to start the series over um, on a saxophone. That's the idea. That's the plan. But first, we got to actually have to beat said games deathless in the first place. Um, so we are tantalizingly close to getting that done with Sekiro. Whoop. There we go. Had to put put the airphone in its stand. Um, but welcome in, everybody. Nice to have you here. Um, uh, Max and Curse Wind, if you need to raid and run, I completely understand. Uh, thanks for being here. Thanks for bringing your community over. And for those of you who are new here, if you'd like to get a better idea of what to expect around these parts beyond what you've already seen, I have a little rated video prepared that I hope catches you up to speed. And for those of you who haven't know the words, please feel free to sing along. I'm starving. What's for breakfast? Guten Tag! Johannes Ross! I bring you arts enriched. Dr. Decomposing. Fortified with increased test scores and creative problem solving skills. It's good! And good for you. Bobby? Susie? Don't worry! That's just the power of the arts! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Dr. Decomposing. I'm a, I'm a whoop. <laughs> Overdrive! I have a doctorate. This isn't silly. One, two, three, four. Run! I have to fight a ball? And there we are. Um, welcome in, everybody. It's nice to have you all here. Thanks for sticking around. Um, we've just beat Genichiro, so that's nice. <laughs> um, how's everybody doing this evening? Um, let's uh, let's hope that this is it. Gentari! Resubbing. Crab, crab, slice of pizza, question mark, exclamation point. Crab, crab, slice of pizza, question mark, exclamation point. Crab, crab, slice of pizza. Question mark exclamation point. Dentari, thank you very much. Uh, ten months. That's incredible. Didn't you didn't we just didn't you just 
have a Twitch baby, like not like not that long ago. That's crazy. Um, is this the Deathless? I hope so. I hope so. That would be neat. That would be nice to be able to move on. <laughs> it would be nice to be able to move on. Let's be real. Though I, I would have to continue practicing this game. <laughs> Solaire, thank you very much. I appreciate it. I appreciate the sentiment. Also, Gentari, how are you feeling? I hope you're feeling better. I feel like you were you were under the weather not too long ago. thing. Okay, let him walk five steps that way. We'll grab this thing back here for... Not having a run, bless redemption, means that I'll use chat and said thank you. Oh, also, um... You can eavesdrop on him. I don't know if I have this mapped on the aerophone. Oh, cheekily pressed my PlayStation button for this. There we go. Run invalidated. <laughs> Lord Ishii. You know there'd be people who would do that to me, right? It's why I've like gotten into the habit of like not using my keyboard when I'm doing like monotonous stuff like menus. Like, oh, he's using the keyboard. It doesn't count. Also, RSY Buchanan, hello. Sounds like your cat is helping quite a bit. Sekiro. I approve. The Sekiro, what is it? is even happening what is even happening Aridin story is true or false at the end of our show next two Ooh, hippies, hippies are wrongly accused of murder, murder. 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 lot. hello oh my god oh my god oh my god let me get to let me get to a spot here get rated man i this is crazy uh, Huang Philippe, welcome in hello indeed how are you doing how did you find uh, my street oh, <laughs> Uh, 193 hello uh, in, scarlet hello. wound Indeed. thank you for the follow how did you find my stream um, welcome oh we got multiple multiple this? kate shout outs hello kate hello how is your stream how are you doing it's nice to see you nice to see all of you how's it going welcome in aridin hello 
Oh my goodness gracious. And Sir Lamalot too. Hello, Raiders. Welcome in. Kate, how's it going? You you streamed late. You streamed late tonight. Holy moly. Um, nice to have you here though. Kate, how are you? How is the new how's the new desk set up? The fancy new desk set up. Um, I hope it's going well. Um, Kate kicked bumps. Oh, she does that every stream. She does like she she kicks ass in every in like every conceivable way. Um, so that doesn't surprise me. Um, I got a raid right as I went to end. Uh, so we went for an extra 40 minutes. I feel that. <laughs> I feel that. I would too. Yes. You killed Sewer Moog. Congratulations. I love that nickname for him. Um, what was, what would, what is the other Moog going to be called? I feel like it's got to also have a, you're going to give him a similarly derogatory nickname. Um, but Kate, thank you so much for bringing your community over as always. I very, very much appreciate it. Um, for those of you who don't know me, some, if, if for somehow, and if you're in Kate street coming to Kate stream and you haven't seen me bully the crap out of her, <laughs> my name is Dr. Decomposing actual doctor, actual composer. <laughs> And uh, we're actually playing Sekiro, uh, trying to do a deathless Sekiro attempt um, with an electric saxophone as a controller. What is even happening? Uh, what is even happening? RSY, I'm not even going to read that out loud. Dickhead Moog, I will read that out loud because he is. It's true. Um, but yes, this is called an aerophone. It's basically an electric saxophone that I programmed to work as a game controller where every note that I play on the instrument corresponds to a button press on the gamepad. There is a little nubbin on the back of the instrument that I use as an analog stick, but everything else in the game is controlled one doot at a time. Yes, I am literally dooting into... I, I'm, I'm blowing into the instrument for it to work. It has an air, uh, air pressure sensor in here. Um, so... Um, we've played games in this fashion, um, games like Cuphead, Ocarina of Time, Breath of the Wild, and the entire From Soft Souls like catalog. That being, oh, excuse me, uh, that being Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne, Sekiro, and Elden Ring. In fact, we've done challenge runs, Zach's based challenge runs of said From Soft games, um, including a Deathless Run of Bloodborne, level one runs of Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring. And now, um, we are tantalizingly close to a level, a uh, not a level one, a deathless run of Sekiro. And we are going to be attempting to play through all of uh, said FromSoft games back to back without dying in a uh, demigod run, a deathless demigod run, um, deathless doot run. Um, and uh, we're we're on our way, <laughs> um, but we got to beat Sekiro first. Um, and Kate, if you need to go um, get your, min your post stream midnight snack, even though it is now much later than that. Um, Cursed Wind, thank you for the follow. Um, if you need to go get your, your, your snack, your snacky, um, I completely understand. Um, and same with the, ra uh, all of you raiders coming in. Um, if you need to raid and run, go and need, uh, do any post stream self care, I completely understand. Um, but thanks for sticking around. Um, and if you are new here and you're sticking around and you want to get a better idea of what to expect around these parts, I do have a little raid video prepared that I hope catches you up to speed. It is, it is indeed Solaire. Um, very, very kind of all of you. Thank you very much. Spatty, thank you for the follow. Um, but if you are new here, you want to get a better idea of what to expect around these parts, I have a raid video prepared that I hope catches you up to speed. And for those of you who happen to know the words, please feel free to sing along. I'm starving. What's for breakfast? Guten Tag! Johannes Ross! I bring you arts enriched... Dr. Decomposing. Fortified with increased test scores and creative problem-solving skills. It's good! And good for you. Bobby? Susie? Don't worry, that's just the power of the arms! <laughs> I'm Dr. Decomposing. I'm a, I'm a whoop. <laughs> Overdrive! I have a doctorate, this isn't silly. One, two, three, four. Run! I have to fight a ball? <laughs> Let me out! Let me out! <laughs> Make your dreams 
come through! Okay! I feel like I cut that off a little early, but um, Kate, thanks again for the raid. I very much appreciate it, um, and welcome in everybody. Why indeed is the question? Um, so the uh, to answer, I, I, try, I think I think it was Solaire. Um, so that is that was a commercial that um, played in the United States, um, I believe, in the late '90s, early 2000s. Um, it's actually a um, public service announcement. It was a public service announcement. Uh, cryptids over crypto. I kind of like that. Um, thank you for the follow. Uh, how are you? Welcome in. Um, but yeah, it's like it's a, a arts council um, public service announcement commercial of some kind, and it's fantastic. Um, but welcome in. Um, also, Spatty, hello. Are you an engineer or a music guy? So when I said earlier, um, when I when I go through my rage spiel, um, actual doctor, actual composer. Um, that is, I'm. That is actually the truth. <laughs> I have a doctorate in music composition. A doctorate in music composition. I used to teach music. Um, I used to teach uh, computer music, intro to co composing, um, all that kind of sort of stuff. Um, and so this is sort of like my um, my my bag. Um, people just started doing it themselves, Solaire. People just started doing it themselves, and then we're, we're, we lean into it. Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> I don't need that yet. So we just need to skip ahead, skip ahead, skip ahead. Um, Kate, are you still there? You doing all right? I hope you had a I hope you had a nice stream. I'm sorry that I wasn't there for a lot of it. I felt bad. Dudes, hello. No problem, Kate. Oh my god. There we go. Sure, nice one. I have a degree in engineering that was only to help myself on um, advance. Thank you. Um, thank you. Uh, thank you very, very much. Um, is that the AUG noise? It is. It is indeed, Sir Lamalot. Uh, good luck on the run tonight. Sunset Miami, hello. Thank you very much.
Oh, another thing uh, for new folks. Um, I normally on normal run on normal streams um, when the stakes are a lot lower. <laughs> um, I normally have something called the wheel of dudes, um, which um, we have a variety of sounds that can actually come out of the aerophone. Um, I have it disabled at the moment just because of uh, how intense this deathless run gets, and it's for my concentration. My my dumb ADHD brain uh, gets it happened. Yes, it gets very distracted very easily. Um, so I uh, I have the wheel de deactivated for the moment. I'm just keeping it on the Shami Sentaiko combo because it works really well for Sekiro generally, um, and it's it's a nice um, percussive sound that I can tell is actually like in time with my playing. Um, so uh, as much as I love Moan Farts, I want to see you succeed. Thank you very much, uh, Mark Apotamus. Thank you for the follow. I think there it is, Mark Apotamus. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, can you disable scare? I can, but it's 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 turned on like every hour or something like that. Um, um, if it becomes a, a, a real thing, then I have a I have another hotkey. I have another hotkey that uh, turns off all um, alerts. So. Take a closer look at that snout. Thank you for the redeems, everybody. Um, the absence of wheel wheel of dudes leaves you with only one option. I am I apologize. Um, um, the model is actually it's a Roland Aerophone AE10. for it um you're building a parry build in elden ring that sounds awesome sir lamalot that sounds fantastic oh they came to me So it, with a parry with a parry build, how does how does that work? I'm assuming then are you are you using shields only, or is it like parry and then using like misericord or something like that, or however you pronounce it? Um, Afro senpai, hello. Hope your Christmas and New Year was great. It was okay. <laughs> but Afro senpai, I hope you had a lovely uh, holiday as well. Um, my, I have, I have travel woes. I have stories of woe and despair when it comes to travel, traveling this season.
Okay. I've been practicing Emma Ishin. Uh, yes. Is that Carl? E. E. Salama, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Um, and thank you for the E. Uh, Carl says, how's the runs treating me? Um, so far, so good. But I also, I'm, I'm still so hesitant to ever say that it's actually going well. Because <laughs> it, it, it's, it's always going well until it isn't. Carl, how are you? It's nice to see you. Self-confidence is so 2022. I mean, it's not so much about not having confidence in myself. It's, uh, it's more of a, a problem with... Miyazaki's always listening, and the minute I start being like, oh yeah, this is going really well, is what is right when I screw it up. My self-confidence boom came through non-TOS means, so you will not talk about it. Thank you. Thank you for that. That's literally what happens, Afro Senpai. All right. <sighs> okay. Mom, please work. It worked. Bravo. Bravo! Well done, Carl. That's about as close as it's ever gotten. Markopotamus, thank you. And Dev, hello. It's nice to see you. Is there a more annoying sound than the screech of chalk against chalkboard? Um, it's a fake. <laughs> uh, the answer is uh, an armored warrior falling to his death saying Robert. Devastating and annoying. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Thanks for the GGs. Um, so does it help that you think you're saying kind of okay-ish, I guess? Yes. Yes. Um, Robert DLC. Uh, they, they, there should have been full-on DLC for this game, but it's a shame that they never got around to it. Okay. Um, onward.
At least that's my cope justification. Uh, it's because they decided to make DLC into Sekiro 2 now. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Uh, any, any Sekiro DLC ended up in Elden Ring. That's what Melania was. <laughs> Straight up. There. Peasy. The first monkey always looks so surprised. Yeah, because I see it. I've never I, I have never been no, I've been hit once during the folding screen monkeys fight. Kate, I, I don't want to do that to you, but I'm I'm trying. <laughs> no, I already did that when I sent you all of those American snacks. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know. It sounds like you're encouraging people to do terrible things.
Alert. Alert. A crab rave has been initiated. Repeat. A crab thank, rave thank, thank, thank has you, been sir, initiated. Thank you, Sir Lama. Get your There's crab been a crab rave. Y'all, yeah, I'm going to continue the run. Repeat. Get your crabs and dance emotes out. But please. Crab, 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 crab. for the crap brave I appreciate it I love crab too, Shalama. What kind of monster would not like seafood? The answer is yes, um, Kenji. screw this up. Not great. Oh, fight the puppet. Not me. Not me. Not me. <sighs> yeah, very, very, very scary. Yeah, Gunfort is scary. Um, I'm not going to say anything until I get to a safe spot, a relatively safe spot.
Oh, Kai, I'm sorry. I uh, I thought I had set it up where you could do that. But um, thank you. For, I appreciate it. Um, I hope you're having a lovely evening. Thanks for being here. What am I doing? Um, nothing yet. Okay. okay. And yeah, um, Sir Lamelot, Sekiro is so worth it. It's such a good game. That's what you do, <laughs> Solaire. <laughs> that's that. That's the thing that I was. Uh, um, I didn't want to say has been working out really well for me. Um, I don't know where I'm at in terms of the timer, Afro Senpai, for the second one. So I always do it just in case. And there's no reason not to, in this run. There's no reason not to. I only need. I only need uh, the Gachin sugar. I only require it, I think, one more time through the entire run, so. No, you don't need it for Monk. I do need one more kill here before I do this next fight. Dang it.
patience. Just needed patience for that one. Thank you for the GG's, everybody. Very weird name. Um, I'm I'm assuming that it makes more sense in Japanese. I'm assuming that it makes more sense um, in Japanese in terms of like context, I guess. Like it might be like, it might indicate some kind of, um, I don't know, like a, like a, some cultural thing that we might not be as aware of in the West. Or like some kind of pun. Exactly, Kate. What a mess. Oh my god, Tarky, I swear to god. I'm, like I said, I'm sure there's an explanation for it. I just, I, I would have to look it up. Okay, here we go. So scary. Yeah, the jump is rough. some bullshit <laughs> hope you all saw that
No, I so I went to I activated that statue that's right before the guardian ape, and I like sat down at it, and before I could hit the rest button, I got shot by a monkey, which uh, exits you out of the uh, menu to rest. Um, I'm going for the shortcut that makes it so I don't have to fight any ghosts. Yeah, so um, the the camo. I try, I try, I try to explain it as much as I can um, when when I don't have something in my mouth. Anyway, um, yeah, so I could pick this up right now for the 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 dried viscera. You literally don't need it. You also don't need this item right here. All you need is that. Yeah, it's funny. I um I there were a couple of people who mentioned at uh, one point where um uh sunset won't, somebody mentioned that they thought you could only warp out of that room and not know that there's a yeah, that there is a shortcut to the poison pool <laughs> that you can get to without having to face um the shamisen warrior or whatever they're called. Shishumi shima 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 shima. Yeah, no, it was not a, that's not a dead end. There's a way out of there. Um a shichimen warrior um, so I don't have to fight one of those. Um, and I can do this in an order where it doesn't require me to fight the guardian ape yet. So no, once you fight the guardian ape, those are coming up. Soul of Niji, hello Raiders, hello, welcome in. Nice to have you here. How's it going? Uh, praise the sun you being invaded by Dark Spirit Niji and his invaders, oh no. Dark Spirits are bad. But Niji's a Niji's not a dark spirit. Niji, uh, Niji's uh, a friend. Hello, Ninja Man. Welcome in. Um, Raiders. Hello, Niji. How are you? What were you up to? Uh, Niji, is it okay if I can uh, give you a shout out? Can I give you a a, a, a clip based shout out? Um, what do you mean, praise the sun? Yeah, Solaris here. It's true. You do. Uh, Soul. You're playing Sekiro as well. How's Sekiro going? Oh, it's your first time playing Sekiro? That's fantastic. Are I hope you're are you having an okay time? <laughs> My first time with Sekiro was traumatic. It was it was very, 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 very difficult. So um, I hope you are enjoying it, um, as it were. Or at the very least not completely pissed off with it yet. <laughs> so uh, no, Afro Senpai, no, that's not what I'm talking about. Um, well actually, technically, yes. Actually, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, anyway. Um, for those of you who don't know me, uh, Raiders, welcome in. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Dr. Decomposing. Actual doctor, actual composer. And we are actually doing Sekiro, playing Sekiro as well. Um, but we're doing a deathless attempt, um, and we're using an electric saxophone as a game controller. Chain Ogre is hard no matter what. Chain Ogre is very, very, very annoying, Niji. So the fact that you got past him is gigantic. Um, but um, 
What is this thing? Oh, this is called an aerophone. It's basically an electric saxophone that I programmed to work as a game controller where every note that I play on the instrument corresponds to a button press on the gamepad. There is a little nubbin on the back of the instrument that I use as an analog stick, but everything else in the game is controlled one doot at a time. We played, ga played games like Cuphead, Ocarina of Time, Breath of the Wild, and the entire FromSoft Souls-like catalog. That being Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne, Sekiro, and Elden Ring. And we've also done challenge runs of said FromSoft games on said saxophone. Um, that includes level one runs of uh, Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring. Um, a deathless run um, controlled via saxophone of Bloodborne. And now we're trying to do a sax controlled deathless run of Sekiro. Um, eventually working our way towards playing every single one of those from soft games I mentioned um, without dying on a saxophone back to back um, in a demigod run, as it, as it were. Um, you got to Gyobu. That's fantastic. That's huge. That's like that's uh, um, for the first stream. That's amazing. Um, but Niji, thanks again for the raid. Thanks for bringing your folks over. Um, I'm glad that you are making progress in Sekiro. That's huge. Um, and uh, thanks again for being here. If you need to raid and run, do any post stream self care. Completely understand. Um, but for those of you who are new and want to get a better idea of what to expect around these parts, I do have a little raid video prepared that I hope catches you up to speed. And I hope. Um, Hope it catches you up to speed. And for those of you who happen to know the words, please feel free to sing along. I'm starving. What's for breakfast? Guten Tag! Johannes Ross! I bring you arts enriched. Dr. Decomposing. Fortified with increased test scores and creative problem solving skills. It's good! And good for you. Bobby? Susie? Don't worry! That's just the power of the arts! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Dr. Decomposing. I'm a, I'm a whoop. <laughs> Overdrive! I have a doctorate. This isn't silly. One, two, three, four. Run! I have to fight a ball? Let me out! Make your dreams come true! Okay! Again, <clears throat> hello again, um, and Niji, thanks again for the raid. Um, uh, one second. One moment.
Star, hello. It's nice to see you. How are you? And Aridin, yes, that's that's basically it. So just be be mindful of your of your words in here, everybody. Um anyway, um let's continue. Okay, um, Snake Eyes. Got Mortal Draw. All right. No. No, that is not what most people call that, Solaire. Um, to be safe, I'm gonna do that on Go Sugar. Got it. Oh, that's where we died last time, so... And so you're you're fine. Um, you're totally cool. And I understand, like, especially if English is not your first language, then like I can I can see how that would be something where you know if you're seeing it in other places, um, you might be uh, confused about it. Oh boy. Um, but generally speaking, um, I would I would put that in the category of like I, I would call them words as a derogatory thing, where I just don't like. Um, you know, there's like certain like ableist slurs and other things that uh, gamers seem to have no problem throwing around um, in like voice chats, and uh, that's th that's one of them. No, Albert, you're fine. I said gamer words.
Shalom a lot. Have a wonderful time. Also, uh, next split. <laughs> I do think it is it is kind of funny to have that as a split. To have Miss Noble as a split. Or sorry, exactly, precisely. Yeah, so there's so far so good. There. How can I tell that would be bad on Deathless Ones? I'm nervous already. Oh, how to tell if it's th things are going poorly, uh, d like going well or not, uh, whether or not I've died. <laughs> I'm glad I'm good at the Sword Saint right now. I've really struggled in the past, but you know, um, Sword Saint, it's, it's really the second phase of the actual Sword Saint fight, which I guess would be phase three of the overall fight is actually, I think, the hardest part. It's just, like, he's got so much stamina. It's ridiculous. Um, I have tried the gauntlets, but I haven't finished them. So I haven't done any of the, like, the inner Genichiro, inner Ishin fights. I haven't done those yet.
Okay. To the temple. Phase one Ishin is easier than Genichiro for sure, I would say. Um, yeah, the, well, the nice thing is that how similar phase one of Ishin, of Sword Saint Ishin, is to um, the, Shura, the Shura run um, Ishin. Oh, this is not where I want to go. I need to talk to Shop Guy. Here we go. So, friend. I think that's all I needed to do at this point. Mm. That's not going to help me for this fight. Neither will any of those things. Sunset Miami Arcade. Have a wonderful evening. Thank you for popping by, and say, popping by this evening and hanging out. Um, I hope you are able to get some good rest. See you soon. Let's see if we can do this completely stun lock approach. Solaire, please, please don't backseat me. No. <laughs> Trust me, I practice this. Don't worry. I got it. Done. Oh, Afro Senpai, it is it is the ooeyest, gooeyest, most delicious cheese. 
So we've got Corrupted Monk done. There's a little bit of cleanup we got to do before we go fight the ape. I said cheese and the cat looked up. Cheese. You know, do you know what um, you say in Japan when you're posing for a picture? When you're posing for a picture? Cheese. Cheese. actually uh c h i with a with an extender on it s u no not quite <laughs> not quite kai <laughs> thank you smedley Uh, coins. I love that name. Close. So it's um, it's called a macron, and it's a it's the it's perfectly horizontal line over the cheese. Oh, is it zoo? Is it uh cheese cheese zoo? Huh. I thought it was uh, su. Okay. But thank you. Also, Smedley. Hello. How are you? It's nice to see you. No, and it's not. It's not the double dot I. <laughs> um, why is it so late already? I want to stay for the run. I'm sorry. We're we're almost at the end. Kaizu? Kaizu. No, cheese. It is a line. It looks double dotted to me on my monitor. Kaizu. I shouldn't have said anything. I shouldn't have said anything. Cheese. Almost monkey time. Almost, 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 almost. We still got... I need to get one more. One more prayer bead necklace piece. And upgrade my prayer bead necklace. And then we can go fight the monkey. Um, Happy New Year. Smedley, Happy New Year as well. Guardian Ape is like... I actually really like the boss fight a lot. Um, it's very tricky though. Um, in in this run in particular, for some reason.
Yeah, Kai, 100%. That's exactly where I'm at with that fight. Um, from here on out, alerts are going to be paused. I might be a little less, a little less responsive in the chat, just because we're getting close to the end here. I don't know at my current attack power level if I'm going to be able to pull this off in one one cycle, um, but there's a way to do this where you can get you can get through most of phase one almost immediately. So we'll see how it goes.
What the fuck? No! Slow and steady, slow and steady. Slow and steady. Phase one's the hard part, but gotta be careful with phase two. Oh my god. Come on.
Ape is done. I'm sorry. Kate, I thought you said that I thought you said that if I got this far that you would shit your pants. <laughs> that ape is a massive dork. Callum, hello. It's nice to see you. How are you? All right. Finally. We're at the end. Turn the fork and shit on his back. Yeesh. Emma Ishin, that's all that's left. Um, anything that I need to do before we head over there? Um, I don't. Is there anything else I need to do? I don't think there is. I don't think there is. I don't think I need to buy any items. I don't think I need to. Taco sugar I could go buy. Benz with the raid. Hello, raiders. Welcome in. Um, you didn't get the normal raid alert because um, we're at the end of the game. But Benz, thank you for the raid. Um, we are trying to do a deathless run of Sekiro right now with an electric saxophone as a controller. And uh, we're at the end of the game. We're at the uh, final boss um, doing final preparations. So please excuse me for not doing the uh, uh, proper, like the full raid video and everything. Um, but we're very, very, very close to getting this, getting this done. Also, talk about that in a second. Anyway. weird. Okay, here we are, y'all. Uh, should I make a prediction? Should I start a prediction here? Maybe I'll do a prediction once we get to the actual safe spot. There's a, there's a safe spot. All right, we're here. We've made it. I'm gonna leave a five minute poll up here. Five minute poll. Get to voting everybody. Will I get deathless? Also, I believe uh, Albert, let's see human do it. No. No, definitely not. 
No, we're 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 at the final bit here. Also, Albert is uh his uh Oregon Trail time machine um is very close to the year ten thousand. Very exciting. Uh five K on yes, oh my god, y'all. Time for Demon of Hatred, yeah no. Maybe by the time I beat this he'll be in year ten thousand. Um anyway, no doubters, thank you everybody. Four minutes remaining to get your votes in. Um should I should I blast off on Twitter? Should I let people know? <laughs> to Camu, thank you. We're all going to blast off when we went, oh boy. Y'all, uh... Go, uh, go retweet that, do the things. Carl, what are you doing? Gonna ban all the no's. No, don't do that. Good <laughs> for the good karma. Oh, boy. So, okay. So, oh, uh, before I do any of this, before uh, we head over to that uh, fight. Switch to that, for sure. Um, just leave the firecrackers on. That's the only thing we'll need. pause again um two minutes remaining two minutes and 10 seconds remaining on the prediction get your votes in thank you for all of the votes of comp i mean thanks for all the votes in general thanks for thanks for putting them points up but uh i will i will do my best i promise um two minutes remaining on the poll on the prediction on the betting um did it just for your points Oh boy. Thanks for thanks for getting that tweet out everybody. I appreciate it. Uh let's see let's see what this ends up being. What if you did it Bambi? This is this is a this is an excellent question. What if I did it? You got this prediction is in the price here making sh Kate shitty. Herself. Yes. Uh the the whole thing here is that I've got to make Kate shit herself. <laughs> Oh my god. Also, um just so just in case uh things get weird, but uh this this one goes to um I believe I believe this one was recorded for, from uh Decapo um for instances like this. Good luck, idiot. Thank you. Um <laughs> Let me just make sure that all of these other uh sound alerts are turned off. Hold on. I think I think so. I think so. I think we're good. Um, Bambi, it's nice to see you. Thank you for being here. Uh, prediction should have been, will Kate shit themselves? Yes or no? Good. Very good question. It's a very good question. 30 seconds remaining on the poll. You saw the tweet. You got to be here. It is, I know it's very late. So thank you for being here. Okay. It's 15 seconds remaining. Hands up, all pants shitters. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and betting is closed. He shit more like he shitting himself. He shitting himself. He shitting himself. Am I right? He he shitting himself in it. Okay, let's go. Mm.
Uh-oh. Here we go. The code is absolute. Or not. Yes. I am. There we go. Come on. And that's Sekiro Deathless, baby.
GG. <laughs> yeah, it's time to shit yourself. <laughs>